Yo, this is the Sky City Studios YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And our sponsors at Alpha Claims and Hire Birmingham, the leading and best accident management company, get a replacement car anywhere in one hour. And we are back in Coventry again. The third teenager to be murdered this year alone in Coventry. And as you can imagine, the youth of Coventry have got a lot of questions and are wondering what the hell is going on. It was only the other week that I was there reporting on the murder of Romani Morgan at a house party. And less than a month before that, Babacar Diagne was murdered as well in the Wood End area of Coventry. The same place that Jaden James was killed back in 2018. And today, the young man hasn't been identified yet, but I've been told by friends in the local area that his name was Abs. I've been sent pictures of him and I've also found out that he was associated to RB7. This is the first time that I'd mention RB7 in a video on the channel due to the fact that I won't name gangs even if I know what's going on until it's public information. I'll be taking a trip to the ops. Dead my day, bad man, dead my day, just sleep on a job. And in the court case of Jade and James, the names of RB7 and C2 have both been mentioned. These are two gangs that are at war in the city at the moment. And before I continue with this story, I want to mention what was said in court in relation to this. Jaden James was known as JJ and he was killed in November in 2018. The prosecution said that he was killed because of an ongoing feud between rival gangs. Opening the case, Mr. Burroughs said on the night of the 24th of November, the RB7 gang based in Coventry City Centre, the Hillfields area, was seeking revenge and drove to the Wood End area looking for members of a rival gang called C. To. They was in a black Peugeot and armed with weapons. And this is the first mention publicly that I found of them gangs in a courtroom connecting them to a death in Coventry. And with this story, Abs featured in all of RB7's videos. A lot of them, if not all of them, think he was involved. Did he deserve it? Nobody deserves anything that's happening out here. This is just a series of decisions that are made, sometimes from childhood, sometimes without even knowing it. And it has and it's resulted in what has happened today. Coventry Police has said that a murder investigation has been launched after a teenager was shot dead. Officers were called to Arnside Close near the junction of Clifton Street in the Hillfields area after reports of a shooting at 2.30. A 19-year-old man was found with serious injuries to his back and was taken to hospital where he sadly died soon after. His family are now being supported by specialist officers. Chief Inspector Scott Griffiths from a homicide team said they are appealing for information and a Volkswagen was seen in the area of VW Golf R. So that is all the police actually have said. They've made two arrests since then in relation to it. They haven't identified the people or their ages, but they're fast moving investigations. The same as all the other murders in Coventry. Every single murder that has happened has been solved fairly quickly. Um, Romani Morgan's murder case uh, the other week, two people have been charged. Jade and James, the on trial. Babacar Diagne, three people are in custody. So these cases are not mysteries as such. They're they are being solved, but with the growing culture in Coventry, due to a lot of things like deprivation, it says that Coventry, especially Wood End, is suffering from a lot of, there's, there's no money being put into the area, the kids are doing nothing, and it, as a result, they're getting involved in gang culture, and then gang culture is being reflected in the music. So I am sorry to have to report on yet another murder from Coventry, but it's early days yet, like I said, this is all breaking news, exclusive stuff, so I really appreciate it if you do take the time to subscribe to try and support the channel and to show people the, the real stories that matter because without you guys these stories wouldn't be out there there's a lot of people that can try to do what we do but at the same time are they really talking about the situations that matter or are they just cashing in on what's going on so i really appreciate you joining me this morning i'll be back again very shortly with some more news and i'll have some updates on this as soon as is appropriate i appreciate you joining me peace I'll be taking a trip to the ops. Then my day a bad man, then my day to sleep on a job. I'll be so a gang, gang. Pull up on the block, then bang.